Hey everyone, how are you today? I went to five and below. I haven't been there in probably a year. I needed some stocking stuffers, which I don't think I really got, but I needed some miscellaneous gifts and um, gift bags and all the rest. So come with me to five and below and see what I got. what I got. So for the girls in the office, I think these are really nice. I have a pair myself. They're nice and soft. And I, th yeah, these are $5 and they're, um, cable knit cabin socks. They call them some cabin socks. So I got one, two, three pairs for the girls that I work with in the office. So I thought that would be quite nice. So that's one thing that I got. Let me get these to the side. Um, that they're getting also, I have notebooks from the Dollar Tree that have Bible verses on them and each page in the book has a Bible verse. So I'm giving that to the girls with this and probably some candy. I thought who, you know, everybody can use a notebook. Everybody loves candy and a pair of socks like that on a cold winter night. You're going to be thankful. These I have bought every year for my guys. They are thermal gloves. One size fits all. I think these are $5 or maybe three, but if you need a good pair of gloves that are thermal gloves, they're not super thick in terms of, you know, trying to wear them and do work, but they're thick enough, but they are super, super warm. And my guys love them. So I always buy them a new pair every year. Now, if you need gift bags, I know Dollar Tree has some beautiful gift bags, very pretty, $1.25 and all the rest, but I find that five and below, does a really good job. So this is six bags for $4. So this is less than a dollar a bag. And you know, they're cute. It's a brown bag. It's got gnome skiing. It says ho, ho, ho on this one. And um, poinsettia pattern. I don't really know if you can see that. Uh, maybe not. Yeah, I don't think so. But trust me, cute bags. But four, four, no, excuse me, six bags. Oh, there's the pattern on there. You can see that maybe a little bit six bags for four dollars i think that's a great deal and that's cheaper than dollar tree so i got two sets of those bags like i told you i'm doing gift bags this year who was it one of my viewers said if i gave her lunch she'd come over and wrap all my presents and i'm like oh i'd love to take if you're watching i forget who it was but i'm like i'll take her up on that i love my gifts wrapped don't have the patience or the time and it was so funny she said we'll have lunch and i'll wrap your gifts i love that so here's a six count for five dollars i got these they have like a gold metallic on them but i thought they could be christmasy if i put christmas paper in it and then there's some that have the red dots and the red metallic but i got these because they're kind of both it could be christmasy or they could be year round and again um, these were a little bit more expensive. These were six for $5 where these were six for $4, but they're a little bit bigger. And I thought just in case I don't need these for Christmas, I have a few gift bags on hand for like, you know, birthdays and, you know, hostess gifts and whatnot. This was a 10 count for $5. So I thought that was a good deal. Same thing. It's gold stripes, gold metallic, gold polka dots. And same thing, gold could be for Christmas. There's gold triangles, and I think that was it, the three patterns. Same thing, good good bags for Christmas, but good bags for year round, male, female, you know, you can add a fun little thing on the front of it to make kid-friendly bags and so on. I got two sets of these, five counts for $5, a dollar a bag, so even if, you know, you go to Dollar Tree, you're going to pay $1.25. So you save 25 cents on a bag. You know, every little bit counts. Same thing here, though. You got blue, you got green, you got white and red. You got your Christmas colors, but these colors could be year-round as well. 
great for kids, adults, and so on. What I always like to do is I add a Christmas ornament. I go and get clearance ones at the end of the year. And I just, I think it's a fun way, a bow and a Christmas ornament. Everybody gets an ornament on their bag. So I got two sets of those. And then I got this one. Now we do not drink any alcoholic beverages in our home. Um, and I know that that's probably what this is for, but I got an unusual long box for my husband for one of his gifts. So I'm gonna have to put it in, I think in a wine bottle bag. So what else did we get? So I'm going to a event tonight. Oops, hang on, it's catching here. I'm going to an event tonight and um, good grief, I just messed it up. I gotta rewrap this, but this was neat and tidy looking. Now it's a mess. And it's at my mom's church and it, they were doing a $5 grab bag. Again, what do you get for $5? Well, those socks would be quite nice. But I saw this, a blanket, an ombre blanket, and it's super soft. Oh yeah, nice. And I thought that's a really nice, you know, it's a throw, but you could use it in your car. You can use it on your couch. It's the kind of thing you don't have to leave out a knickknack and find a place for it. Everybody can use an extra blanket. So it does come with a little bow kind of wrapped up real nice for you. So I'm going to be using one of these bags, but I think I have to tweak it. It got a little crushed in the bag. So I thought that was a nice, it was $5.55. I purchased this for myself. I love these, this clip here. I love the, the shimmer. Let's see. There we go. And it's, um, you know, the back of your phone, you do the pop socket. Well, I don't like the pop sockets. I like these. It lays flat, perfectly flat to put in your pocket and you just lift it up and I can hold it. And it also sits on your desk. I like it. And this was $4 and that's for my new phone case. I picked these up. I thought these were going to be for a birthday gift for someone. I ended up getting them something else. So I might give this to my daughter-in-law, but it's scented felt felt tip pens it was five dollars and peony rose um can't tell some of these sandalwood i think they yeah vanilla bergamot lavender they're like essential oil scents but they got cut off a little bit because of the circle but you get 16 in here for five dollars and they look like really nice pens and i did you know what i might give these to my daughter-in-law because I bought her a coloring book, for an adult coloring book, Harry Potter. Um, Heather, you better not be listening to this, but I might give these to her to go with her Harry Potter coloring book. So I'm not into Harry Potter. I've never watched Harry Potter, but my daughter-in-law has a fetish with Harry Potter. Now, my son, he's a bit quirky, my oldest son. He's like his mother. And we like to try new things. And he's always into these personality tests. And he likes taking a new one and seeing what it says. So I found this. It's the book of personality test. 25 easy to score tests that reveal the real you. I got it more as a joke, nothing else. And it's, you know, it says, who are you on the back? I don't know. It just looked, are you a psychopath? There's <laughs> one of them there. Um, what else did it say? What is your emotional intelligence level? Um, I don't know. Let's see. What should you do with your life? It just had some quirky little topics, I guess. I thought it'd be a fun, uh, coffee table style book. He has a group that comes to his house every Tuesday. It's called life group for their church and it's young adults. And I, they're always looking for things to sort of, you know, after they have their Bible study, they have all kinds of food and fellowship. So I thought, you know, pull this out, let some of them work on it and have fun. So I thought that might be kind of nice. They have a lot of games and um, you probably saw that in the pictures that I inserted. But this one, Kerplunk, remember Kerplunk? Anybody? I, this is one of my absolute, I'm sorry, that shadow is so bad. That was my absolute favorite when I was growing up. I loved Kerplunk. So it's a mini version of it. It was $5, but I picked that up to add to one of my relative's gifts that I need to put together. I got a lot of stuff. So grab your coffee if you haven't grabbed your coffee yet, because we're gonna be here for a minute. So let me empty out my other bag and see what I got in here. Okay. 
So this I got for one of the girls in the office who does a little bit more with me and um, works alongside with me on my podcast and does goes above and beyond. We kind of have a different relationship. So I thought she might enjoy this. It is called Good Vibes Only Includes, and you get the canvas, and you can paint the canvas, and it comes with a hanger, and then it comes with the paints and the paintbrush. So I thought that was really nice. She likes simplistic art things, and I thought she just might enjoy doing that. So I got that, and then I also got her a book, Everyday Grace, Guided Writing Prompts Inspired by Prayer. So it has a Bible verse in it, and then it has some questions and about the passage, and you can write your, your thoughts in here and so on. So I picked that up. I thought that was quite nice. That was $5 as well. So that will be for her. And then for one of the guys that I work with, he's actually the one that helps me record my podcast. If you watch my podcast, Hope for Today, if not, many of you have asked about it. And um, it comes out on Tuesdays at 1.30 in the afternoon. You can catch it on Facebook. You can catch it on um, YouTube. And I forget all the other podcasts. I even forget some of the, the names of all the other podcasts. If you need to know, let me know. But you can definitely catch it on YouTube. Hope for today with Lynn Wilson. Just type that in. You'll come across my podcast. It is faith-based. But if you enjoy, you're into the Bible, come and check out my podcast. And it's always about how we have hope for tomorrow. You know, we have hope for today and for tomorrow. It's an encouraging podcast. But he helps me with that. He's a guy. Where do you get guys? I don't know what to get guys. I have three guys in my own family, but another guy. So I saw this, the impossible puzzle. It's a translucent puzzle. Can you see that little puzzle piece right there? It's a hundred pieces and the whole thing is clear, like clear plastic, like clear glass look. But I thought, I want to get one for me. I said to my husband, that would be fun to do. You know, you usually match the colors or if it's a barn, you're matching it up. This is all clear pieces. So I'm giving him that along with something else that I ordered from QVC that I'm waiting to come. All right, we've got a few more things here. Let me get them out and I will show you. So one of my cousins who is special needs and... Um, needs things on a simpler scale. One of those things that's like, she has trouble with her hands and she can't position her hands right. And she has lots of difficulties. So my, my cousin, it's his daughter and his sister, my other cousin, likes to do crafts with her. So I picked this up for her. I thought, how, you know, how cool would that be that we could, you know, maybe sit down Christmas Eve when we get together or if she wanted to do it at a later date and put together a gingerbread house by Hershey's. These are $5. They had Reese's, they had Hershey's, they had a farm one, they had all kinds. If you, I think I actually inserted a picture. If not, let me try and insert it here. They had such a variety of these for $5. So I even thought, you know, these would be cute for the girls in the office. Everybody gets a gingerbread house. Who doesn't like putting those together? Then I also picked up this chess set. They used to sell a really nice chess set and it was glass pieces and I was hoping to get that. I have to show you one of the gifts that I'm making. Hopefully I'll be able to show you, but it's a personalized chess set with photographs of my kids on it. My son's on one side, my daughter-in-law's on the other. Again, it's for their life group. My son loves to play chess, but I bought the board, it's glass and you have an insert, you can put pictures underneath it, but it didn't come up it didn't come with the chess pieces. So I was hoping to get glass ones, but they didn't have it. But they did have this chess set for $5. So the pieces are these colors. So I think that's what I'm going to use for the chess pieces. And I looked on Amazon and the prices of glass chess pieces. And we'll get the plastic. They'll be fine with that. And then I did pick up one extra one. Um, I have someone else in mind in the family that I might give them that for Christmas. And then I picked this up. I think this is the last thing that I have. Yeah, it looks like it. So it's an LED tracing pad. And it says for ages eight and up. I would love this. So you put something underneath it and you can trace it. There you go. You can see that. See it on that side. And plug and use. LED light up. 
fits standard um, five by eight, five point eight by eight point three sheet size, uh, powered by USB, and this was five dollars. So if you need something fun for you know a kid in your life at any age, this might be a fun alternative for something that you would like to you know learn how to trace, maybe draw certain things. This might be something fun to do. That is what I got at five and below. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked anything about it, oh, please subscribe. I'd love to have some new subscribers and give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. I'd love to hear from you. Is there anything in this stash that I got that you felt like was a wow that you know, you've know you gotta run out and look for? I love watching other people's videos of what they get because then it gives me ideas of, that's a great idea for Christmas or a birthday or, you know, I like to have things on hand like I would buy things like this or maybe this book here because if I needed a hostess gift or a last minute birthday gift or that kind of thing, I've got stuff on hand. So anyway, that's what I got for you. I hope you enjoyed this video and we'll catch you all on the next video. Bye-bye.